that I should redouble my efforts to achieve the unachievable dream of being an actor. A journey that has left me eager to connect with my true love. Particularly if she finds her way clear to covering a 2,000 rupee city of hopelessness hospital debt. The trick is going to be getting anyone to believe that her husband is straight enough to have a true love that's a woman. What are you implying? Boy, I don't think there was any implying going on at all. Didn't hear any implying. What's it implying? I'm sorry, Mother. It's just I've got a bit of a stick up my bunghole about what I've now found is a running joke about me. But let's be honest. For 2,000 rupees, we'd both go down a Matthew McConaughey. Yes, Michael? 2,000 rupees was $36. I wouldn't. So Lindsay and Tobias were making a you new start as a family. family. And Michael was making a new start without one. Now. As Michael prepared to sell, the Funkes prepared to buy even though they'd have no money until after the testimony. Are you ready to make a move? As you can see, I'm ready for a lot that's new. Oh, good heavens. Right, well, this is a great area. There's some wonderful surgery centers nearby. We're doing it. <laughs> we're really doing this. Yes, we're gonna get you in the right house. It's just the two of you, you have no children? We don't. We should be honest here. We have no income flow. No incoming income flow. We have plenty of outgoing income. No savings, no credit. I mean, we had some stimmy. But that went to his hospital bills. But there's one thing we do have. Work ethic. All right, no work ethic. But there's one thing we do have. We do have a daughter. I was just on autopilot before yes, when no, I said we didn't. I, I should have caught that. Yeah. <laughs> I could have spoken up, but I just wanted to see if you guys got there. Well, you guys seem like a great family. We have to be realistic. I'm in the real estate business. It's 2006. That's all good enough for me. We're gonna put you in a ninja loan. No income, no jobs, no assets, and you don't have to pay a penny for two years. Oh, ninja, please. <laughs> so we'll take something cozy and intimate, a uh, one bedroom. We're bigger. Yeah, how about something nice, a three bedroom? Three does sound bigger. Oh, it definitely is. You have to remember that this was a time when banks were eager to create as much debt as possible. Five bedroom, four car garage. And I know that you guys are gonna be okay with just one master bathroom, because a lot of people do prefer two. You know, they like to just have it. Maybe separate, so we have it. So we have it, that way we have it. That way you have it. Do you think we really need one? I'm just gonna interrupt for a second. You don't need a wine cellar if you want to do wine tastings in your butler's kitchen. I mean, this really isn't what we discussed. Well, we didn't discuss any of this, but uh, yes, uh, I guess that way we, we oh, have it. Yeah. That way you'll definitely have it. And then once you have it, that way you'll have it. But do we need a gatehouse? I just put John Beard into a house with a double gatehouse. Now that's John Beard, he's on television. No one's gonna look down on you just because you have less than John Beard. Is this crazy? I think so. We'll take the double gatehouse. Oh, is that what you thought? Well, because that way we'll have, we have it. it. We have it. And that way you have it. There I was a lot of this really going on back then. Way, and I could this tell way we have it. That way you'll have it. <laughs> Good point. <laughs> and Tobias began pursuing the life of an actor. I'm an actor. You're an agent. You do the math. You know I'm not that kind of agent, right? I'm a real estate agent. I'm a predator. I sell giant houses to very poor people who can't afford them. All you need to do is tell people what a terrific actor I am, because I can't do it believably. What do you say? Sounds like it shouldn't be too much work. <laughs> Huzzah! And soon, this out-of-work actor and his enlightened wife were starting their life in their new home. <laughs>